We first met Michael Padgett in Cedar Key the night before Hurricane Italia made landfall in Florida's Big Bend region. Oh, we're definitely staying. Italia battered his island community for hours on Wednesday. The images were dramatic. Cedar Key was underwater, and we couldn't help but wonder how Michael fared through the storm. We found him Thursday morning, helping others and cleaning a local deli. Uh, it was really windy and the water got really high, but I mean, it wasn't terrible. I lost power and water, but I'm still here. Now, what do you think when you walk around and you see the devastation here? Oh, it's a mess. It's going to take a while to clean up, but I mean, we're a good community, so we should help each other out and be done fairly quick. Residents started to come back to Cedar Key to assess the damage, to start cleaning, but just take a look at the level the water reached in this island community. It's about a meter and a half. All that water came in damaging restaurants, businesses, and homes. The island town prides itself on being an isolated community for nature lovers and artists. Its population, around 800 full-time residents, many returning to see firsthand what Hurricane Idalia did to their paradise. Amy Firestein owns the Faraway Inn. Rest in peace, Faraway Inn. The wind and record storm surge destroyed two of her cottages. That building on the end down there is going to come apart. Others were severely damaged. People have lost their homes, their businesses, their livelihood. So Cedar Key is struggling right now. It's a great community. They welcomed us. We've had this business two years in November, and they've welcomed us with open arms. It's a great community. Everybody helps each other and wants to help each other, and we want to rebuild. We want Cedar Key back. She's fortunate to have insurance. Others do not. Uh, no. There's no, no flood insurance on, on the, any of these low-lying buildings. So only anything caused damage by water, they won't cover. So how are you planning to rebuild? <laughs> Get loans, I guess. An unnamed hurricane destroyed the island way back in 1896. Not Idalia. I think we got lucky. It could have been way worse, but this is definitely one of the worst ones that I've seen. Nitsa Soledad Perez, CGTN, Cedar Key, Florida.